Hey guys, welcome back to Discover University with our girl Sky here, who is currently doing homework. She's got a few people she's invited. Sika, Dean's come over, Bailey as well came out, Braylon and Jerome. And they're all just getting... She was just like, I feel like studying. I want to do some studying. And you know what? Some studying is what she's going to do. She's going to get all her homework done. And then she's probably going to come back and get her presentation done ready for... What was it? The sunlight cycle. Yeah, because her next... Because once she's done that, she can then probably give the presentation on Monday. Yeah, she's got five days left of time. So she's got plenty of time. She's got uh, two classes. Her last two classes tomorrow. Archaeology and CSI, and she's also got study for those for a uh, study for for those two because it's final exam, which I believe will be on the last day of the semester. But currently, she's getting lots of homework done, or at least just getting her homework done. There's also a study spot, so it'll get through much quicker. She's also in a very good mood because she and Braylon made it official in the last episode. I don't know where Braylon went off to. I think he's up somewhere. Either take a nap or he went home. He's around here somewhere. He's around here somewhere. Oh, there he is. He's napping on the, uh... He's just napping on the bench. Napping on the bench. Bailey's still just making time to clean everything up. She's just like... Just like, this place is filthy. I just have to clean up. But she's currently just having a conversation with Dean and Jerome. Jerome looking very uncomfortable. Not sure why. But he's sitting all the way over there. And then we got these two who came... Oh, Courtney Way, the librarian. Who, might I, might I say, looks very much like a librarian. And then you just got this girl, Izumi. Who's a member of the Brainiacs, which is a study group. I believe. And who's that? Mar oh, it's Marika. Wait, she was one of our... Oh, she was like one of our first like roommates from the dorm. Oh yeah, I wonder where she got up to. And uh, it seems Seeker is just chatting with her while she does research, which is all good. Which is all good. Oh, you're not feeling good. You're not feeling good. I'm hoping that once she's got all her work done and her classes are finished, she might take uh, Braylon back to Solani and just have him meet her dads because Leity did message her being like, congratulations on your new boyfriend, sweetie. So proud of you. Which is all nice. It's, it's, it's nice. It's nice that her dads are all like very invested in her. Oh. In her, uh, we need forest pathology. That's the other one we gotta do. And then also the sunlight cycle. Just get all the homework done. Then she can also focus on her presentation. She's still got her keg. She's got a bunch of robotic parts, some slides, a book on biology, which I think she can study for. Can she? Stu yeah, she can study with that one, which is good. And also her meditation stall on the yoga mat. Which she hasn't had time to use yet, which is kind of a drag. But when she passes this semester, she'll have five credits and she'll just have seven left. Which I'm not sure how we'll break it down. So I might have to break it down into four and three. Or three, three, one. Not too sure. I'll have to think about that one. Archaeology level three. Nice. Nice. Hello, Braylon's joining me. Oh now, oh. Kylie Graves, another Brainiacs member. Oh, so I think he's just like, ah, I've revitalized from my nap. <laughs> Thankfully, these guys are over here studying. It's nice that just the people she's invited are all just like, yeah, we'll study with you. It's all good. Where did you get that cookie from? <laughs> and this girl's just come along and just started chatting <laughs> with her. Just come and start chatting with her. She's just like, that's cool. Gotta get my homework done though. Although it's good that this study spot allows you to get homework done. Quickly, Bailey's doing research. Seeker's just staring at a bookcase, staring off in space. Not sure where you're going. But so long as Sky gets all our homework done, it's all good. It's also like six in the evening. So I'll probably have her finish all our homework and then get, uh, get back home with all our mates. And probably start on her presentation as well. Or go for a quick dip. That might be the other thing. These guys. Being like, we're all going to head back to the house. Yeah, she's like, cool, I'm going to stay here. Just get some more studying done. Because she's still got one more piece of homework to do. Because she's finished 
intro to pathology. She's just got to get her sunlight cycle stuff done. And then she can head on back and get start on her presentation and get start on her studying. Because that's going to be the other thing to do. Currently she's just saying goodbye to them all. Maybe she'll go and get, get some more adventuring. Then maybe she'll find some, some adventuring to do, perhaps. Uh -huh. Who knows? Notice, I don't know who this woman is. Izumi. I think she was also one of her other court, like, dorm mates at one point. But she's just sort of here. Just sort of just, like, been doing studying all evening. And Eve's here as well. Eh, cool. Okay, once she's got her homework done, it's time to go on home. And then she can go and shower, play some video games, and maybe also just get the rest of her needs up. Gardening level 5. Nice. Nice. She can make hybrids now. Ooh, a hybrid coconut tree. Now there's an idea. It makes plantains, it makes bananas and coconuts. It's a cocoa banana tree. Yeah, everyone's just up here on the uh up here in the living area. Ah, oh, poor Templeton. He, I mean he's okay for now, but his activity's a bit low. Just needs to have a bit of a run around and a play. I don't know where Seeker is. I think he's out. I think Seeker's still out, maybe. Off somewhere. Currently I'm just getting all her needs up. And then probably gonna... What is that? There's a note on the floor. Forget taking a shower for a moment. There's a note on... The floor there. That she has to read. I know you're, you're feeling scaly and smelly. But... I took... I was like, where's Seeker gone? But then I just saw this note on the ground. And what does it mean? I hope he's okay. Oh, that's just rude. Sky is perfectly nice. She's just like in an angry mood. She's just like, excuse me. Which passive aggressive roommate is leaving all these annoying notes all over the place? She cleans up, doesn't she? She's not loud. You're off out. And I would tell you to go to the, uh... I would tell you to go to the, uh... I have a shower now, but I think, yeah, Bailey's in the bath now. Bailey's in the bath. Bradley's up here. I don't know where Zika's gone. Oh, but I was like, has Zika just dropped out and left a note? There's also a note over here. There's a note here as well. They just leave them by the beds. Now she's got to read that note as well and find out who on earth's leaving passive-aggressive notes everywhere about... Uh, I mean, it seems Seeker, I don't know. I think this is it's just like a random thing. I think it's just a random thing, but it's like, rude. Rude. How rude. How rude. Also, Bradley, that's rude, going into her mini fridge and eating the cake. Braylon's just coming, coming in. Braylon's also her soulmate, which is... Okay. He's just... <laughs> He's got another cake. She's just like, where are you getting all these sweet treats and cakes from? It's just like, there's a bakery I work at. It's like, I work part-time in this bakery and they've always got food. They've always got just like leftover cakes that no one ever buys, so I just bring them home. And he left again, and what's he going to bring back this time? And he's got cookies as well now. Cake and cookies. I'm not sure where where Braylon's always getting all these cakes and cookies, uh, but sticking them in the fridge Naga! is probably the best bet for us. You know, I wanted to come down. Goby? He's <laughs> no, just sort of like, hey, over. she's just like, hey, I'm making Sway. salad for everyone. It's like, I've made salad room? for everyone. Uh, it's she... good quality and also it's super healthy because <laughs> oh. you guys don't need to. Uh, you guys probably shouldn't be eating cake all the time. And poor, poor Bailey is just so, it's just like uber sad. So what kind of, ro what is that rodent up to? Templeton, what are you up to? What are you doing? You doing little experiments? He's starving though, so, should I mean, he's got food. It says his thing's like still full, so. Probably just. Oh no! He did the thing where he fell over and he kind of like spun around on the wheel. That's so cute. It's so freaking cute. I know the My First Pet stuff one is like. 
uh, like the controversial pack because you need cats and dogs just to already just to have like the uh, just to have the uh, like the the stuff you know the the cat and dog accessories and stuff but you know at least the the, the good thing is is though that you know even if you don't have that one it's fine because you don't need you don't need that pack to play with the uh, to play with the critters. At least that's what I'm just try I've been trying to say. And I still don't know where Seeker is. All right, I'm thinking we play some video games, we go to sleep, and then we probably go off to uh go off to our first class or to our class tomorrow. And we've also got to get a start on this presentation as well plus study for our finals as well but the finals aren't till Tuesday I know the, the finals aren't till Monday so that's absolutely fine she's got a couple days to uh for that one and she's just got to get her basically maybe after her finals she can just take her presentation so as long as that's all good it should be fine oh look at that her fun gets up really quickly when she's playing so she doesn't need to play very much to have like a good time. Just get her fun up. Was that excellent? Eating great vegetarian food. That's always good. That's always good. Okay, so time to go to sleep. And then tomorrow you've got class at 9.30 and then 1.30. She's got class at 9.30, although it didn't say that she had class in hour 8.30, so that's going to be that's gonna be a thing. And of course she's going to be doing her squeaks, because that's just all she does. What outfit shall we give her for her class today? She wears that one a lot, that's also a good one to have. Yeah, now it says her class starts in an hour. Maybe that one, or whichever one of these two. Uh, let's go with this one for now. Let's go with outfit number three. That's always a good one. Bailey is up and just probably going to have breakfast. She's just like getting dressed. Now I've got class in a little bit. Uh, Bradley's sad again. It's easy to know when what Bradley's up to because he gets very sad. He's so easy, he's so easy to tell what his emotions are because he just radiates radiate sadness you were our roommate but I don't know what happened to him he's not our roommate anymore and you know Bradley's an alien but you know he's also a sad alien oh don't break again every time it's doing the thing where she's like, oh, you're not at class. And it's like, well, actually, she should be at class. I gotta just go to class and see if that works. Because now she's missed, like, half of it. And now it's going to be like, oh, she barely showed up to put in a decent grade. And it's like, well, actually... It's just the game doesn't do the thing where they don't get to class on time for some reason. And I don't know how we're supposed to fix that. I think it's to do with the with the with the speeding up thing. All right, she's off to class now. She got decent grades. That'll help with her final grade. So that's all good. She does have another class at 1:30, so I'm going to have her just do the homework for pathology for a little bit until she can head to her archaeology class. So there we go. Intro to pathology just do that down here. Everyone else is out currently. Well, Bradley's still in. Bailey's in. I think Braylon's napping. And I think Seeker has just left. Or he's bugged out and he's just not a roommate anymore. He should be our roommate is the thing. I think she's currently just getting her homework done. Hello, Bradley. How are you today? Feeling better? Sorry but Sky's got lots of work to do. And <laughs> Braylon <laughs> back at it with the floating heart cookies. He finds them everywhere. He just like I swear he just puts in an order like every day for just floating heart cookies. 
and then we're just like, cool, more sweet treats for the fridge. I think I know. I know why all these stuff get all this stuff gets made. It's for the it's for the uh, secret society. It's for the secret society. But it's just so funny that it's just like always like bloody heart cookies and burger cakes just always in the house. Poor Bailey. She's had a nasty breakout. That's a very nasty breakout. Alright. Stop that. And then you've got to go to class. Now, it should. Yeah, it does the thing where it doesn't tell her. There we go, go to class. So now she should be off to archaeology. Oh, she's tired, but you know, she can get the home she can get the class done, and then she's got the weekend to study for her finals and get her presentation done. Who's that? Who are you? Everyone else just gone. This guy just came in. You are new flatmate. Apparently not. You're just... It's just Dion. He's just turned up. has come straight over to Bradley. I'm just curious as to... Sure. Sure. I'm, ju I'm just like, okay, this guy's just turned up at our house. Who does he, like, who is he in relation to us? Just some rando. Just run yeah, you're super tired. Super tired, you can just go straight to bed. When you get back. And then she's got all her homework to complete and then her presentation to do. But she does also have to bring Braylon to Solani to meet her dad. That's going to be the other thing. Turned her homework confidently that class and squeezed every bit of knowledge she could out of it. Nice. See, she's doing really good in her archaeology class and she's got the final exam on Monday. She's got the final exam for that on Monday as well as the final exam for pathology on Monday. Half the homeworks for that's done, she still needs to study for that, and she still needs to get the presentation done. So what I'm thinking is she goes to sleep, then she eats, has some fun, then she works her little butt off getting her presentation completed. Alright, get up, because I think the... yeah. Templeton needs some food. He's, his hunger's okay, but he's got low attention, as well, but his bottle needs to be filled up, so... Just ask him about his day, ask him about rodents in general, and just talk to talk to Templeton. I feel like Temple. No, no, I have aging off. I say I have aging off, so Templeton shouldn't die. It would be very sad if the uh, if the rat dies. But she's just like, here you go, Templeton. More little foodies for you, and he's just like, hey. I love how that gives her a nice mood, like nibbles and bits. Rodents are super cute when they get excited for meal time. I mean, look at little Templeton. Look at him. He's very, he's a very adorable little rat. Just like, huh, what is this? So she's just chatting with her. Yeah, he's in a good mood now. So then we'll shower. We'll take a nice shower. Braylon's back. Everyone's back now. I'm not sure where they've all been. I assume they've all just been out at the, like, maybe at the union or just studying. In general, Seeker's back. Seeker's back. I just added him back as a roommate because I was like, I think he's just... He got bugged and he's no longer part of our little household. But now he's back. Now he's back. And now she is cleaning up. She, like, Bailey cleans the house quite a bit. Bailey cleans the house quite a bit, but Sky does make food for everyone. But she does need to, uh... Well, she wants to play some juice ball. You can do that in a bit. Now you need to shower and eat. Shower, eat, maybe also get some, uh, get your fun up as well. And then you have to get a start on your presentation, she's got so much stuff she needs to do. Bradley, you're sick, you probably shouldn't be near her because otherwise she's going to get the flu. 
next, and that's not going to be fun. Nobody likes to get the flu because it's just not fun. Yeah, she's tense now. She's just like Bradley. If you get, if you give me the stumpy flu, I swear to God. I swear to, to like Maui and all my other Sulani gods that I'm gonna go and uh, I'm just gonna go and just get so mad. Although poor Bradley's very uncomfortable. I think that everyone else is just sick, and she's the only one who's not. She garg. He's just sneezing everywhere, and Rayla's just like, "Oh God, are you sick? Please don't get the rest of us sick." Please don't get the rest of us sick. It's almost winter. This is the last thing we need. He's talking about grilled cheeses. Okay, she's... There you go, she's cleaning up. She's cleaning up. Alright, time to just get a little bit of fun up, and then it's time to work on this presentation. That's gonna be... very, very... fun. But she's in a good mood now because her vegetarian traits are being met. Her vegetarian needs being met because she's the only one who's eating, like, like all the healthy stuff. Everyone has, like, the cakes are still vegetarian friendly. But, uh, yeah, they're all just, it's just super unhealthy in general. They're all just down here. Just eating. Even Brayla's just, like, making sure everything clean. Cleans up good, and she's just like, I've got to get my work done. Oh yeah, I forgot you were in this. <laughs> I forgot I was supposed to be sending your daughter to university, but I uh, I didn't. I think he's wanting to come in and do a little bit of neck biting. But sorry, sorry, Sammy. As much as I love you, as much as I love you, you know, please don't, because we don't want no vampires today. We don't want no vampires today. There we go, off he goes. I completely forgot I, I had him in the series. Because I, I was supposed to be sending his daughter to university as well, but... It just, it's, it's hard enough to just deal with Sky. Having two people would be hard, even though... Caitlin is a vampire, all I could do is just have her study. Because she doesn't need to sleep. But it would just be very difficult to manage up to two people. Alright, all your fun's up. Okay. That's all good. And your tense moodlet's going away. It's time to get started on the presentation. This is going to be the most important thing, because if we don't get this done, we're going to fail, and we really need to get our grades up. I mean, she got like a D in photography, which is all good, but she's got at least two other classes that she needs to take finals for. And she's also got to complete the homework for those and then study for them. But getting this done, because she's already got the homework completed for this one. That will be important. She might have to do the presentation after her exams. And she just keeps stabbing herself with thumbtacks. How do you keep stabbing yourself with thumbtacks? I like to think that whenever Skye's doing like her stuff on like, you know, intro to pathology or the sunlight cycle, she focuses on or, like the Solani nature. Like for the sunlight cycle, she's probably talking about how, you know, the benefits of photosynthesis and just the sunny, like, region of Solani is so great for all the tropical plants and stuff. I like to imagine that a lot of her biology, like all the stuff she relates to, like all the stuff she studies, she just relates to. She uses Solani as like her examples. Probably because it's like it's very important to when she will be going into marine biology when she graduates. And then she'll be going back to Solani and just maybe just maybe Brayla might be coming with her. Is that another note? <laughs> People leaving notes everywhere. But Braylon just might be coming to uh Solani with her. It depends. It depends. He does seem very kind of just sort of sad right now, but I think he's just tired and ill, because Bradley has just now given everyone stumpy flu in this house, I think. Alright, that's basically all the information gathered, and I think she can capture more information and then refine and organize everything. Yeah. Refine and organize. 
refine it, organize it, make it look good, because that's a very sad looking like portrait of like all the bacterias. Refine and organize it, and then practice presenting. And it's basically done. Then you can leave that until you have to give your presentation. And then you've got your homework. But also, because it's Saturday, Saturday or Sunday. Either one of them, she's going to be taking Braylon to Sulani to meet her dads. Because he kind of saw them at the beach in Mopalam, but he didn't actively like sort of say hello to them. He was a little bit nervous about meeting her, just knowing that her dads were there. So she might want to introduce him to them formally. With Sky's presentation all done and looking excellent. Oh my god, there's like a, there's like a screen capture from Island Living. I love that. I think that's from Get to Work. That might be from Cats and Dogs. But that's cool, like these sort of screenshots. Yeah, these are definitely Moopalam images. I'm just gonna have her put the book away and then just go to sleep because she's super tired. Braylon's just taking a bath to de stress. Seiko's just been playing that violin for hours now. And I think Bradley is, yeah, asleep as well. Bailey is also asleep. Oh, there's a note here as well. Read that and then go to bed. Because now the roommates just leave little notes by their beds I've seen and I think most of them are always just passive aggressive. It's just passive aggressive notes. I haven't seen any nice ones. Yeah, about these notes. They're all just kind of eh. Oh, the, the note disappeared. love the dish you just used. Just like, guys, stop leaving the dishes everywhere. How's Templeton? Templeton's good. Templeton's okay. Templeton's okay, guys. Just like, oh god, I'm just going off to sleep now. And there we go. I think everyone is basically just, yeah. I think now the, the whole house is just sleeping. Which is not too bad. Not too bad, but Sky's just got to finish her homework, and then I think in the next episode she is going to... School Spirit Day! Yay! That's great! We could stop by the campus, but not going to. So I'm thinking in the next episode, Sky takes Braylon to uh, Solani to meet her dads. So it's all like, Dad, this is my boyfriend Braylon. Braylon, this is my dad. That kind of thing. And Because he's kind of met them, but he needs to meet them properly. And I think Lirti's already like super happy that Sky's found someone at uni. He's just like, proud of you, sweetie. Proud of you, sweetie. I do want her to get some more friends. She's already friends with the rat. That's so cute. That's so cute. I want her to make some more friends. See if we can meet some more some more of the other sims I put down in the world. That'd be cool. And also, need her to study for her finals and then give her presentation. She just has to practice presenting and then she's ready to go and uh, she's ready to do her presentation. Which is all good, but for now, I think I'm going to finish this episode here. This felt kind of short. This felt like a short one. But that's pretty good anyway. So thank you guys so much for watching. The next episode, Salon is going to be going back to Salani. Braille is meeting the parents. And also, hopefully... Uh, she's going to also be able to finish her final semester and get her presentations and her... Actually, she can do a presentation on Monday. The finals are on Tuesday. I think. No, the finals are on Tuesday. The finals are on Monday. But she could probably also do her presentation on Tuesday as well. So that's going to be the plan. So next episode, the finals and doing a... Meeting the parents. So... Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye now.